Task number two. You are the ultimate fussy eater. Whilst ordering lunch, ask as many annoying questions as you can. Mmm, supper time. Hi, can I order the spaghetti noodles, but can I have the square ones instead of the, the round ones? Does your dough have gluten in, do you know? Do you have barbecue sauce? Do you do rabbit noodles? You don't do any rabbit. Ostrich, you do chicken. Yeah. And what seasoning do you use? Which type of cheese do you have? Do you have three cheese? And do you have Stilton? And how strong is the cheddar you have? Is the Parmesan like shavings or it's like this? Oh, yeah, that's, that's fine. Um, do you have mushrooms? Because if I can't have any mushrooms, it reminds me of my ex girlfriend. Oh, my. It's important that for me that the sauce is cooked over 150 degrees. Yes, of course. Definitely over 150 yeah, yeah. degrees. Can I have olives, but can I have them cut in half? Do you have green olives? No, only pepper. They never have green olives on pizza, do they? Why? And what is the texture of the, the, the pasta? Uh, we make pasta with semolina. Is that the British semolina or no, Italian it's semolina? Italian. That's the, my favourite. Yeah. Do you have portobello mushrooms? <laughs> <laughs> so how many minutes do you cook your pasta for? Three minutes. Three minutes is a good time. And some onions. Did you grow those onions? No. no. Oh, OK. Maybe you should marry me. I need a woman like you in my life. My goodness. Thanks very much. Take care. Thank you. Yeah! 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 Melvin, you are the winner. So, Melvin's team, you get a point. Yeah! Yeah! Uh, right, it's now time for Grimmy Investigates. Now, the way this works is that I recently asked the followers of our Twitter, at BBC Sweat, uh, what their biggest sweats are concerning a specific topic. I will then pick one of those sweats and attempt to investigate it for them. Uh, and once again, Melvin, I know you like this. I think that this deserves a detective series opening title sequence. Last week, I dressed up as the very erotic star, Miss Marple. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, wow. There she is. Uh, but this week... <laughs> I've dressed up as Ironside, and for one <laughs> final time, you're fucking welcome. <laughs> Good acting. Come on, Buster. Uh, anyway, this week's chosen sweat topic was what's the most annoying weird phobia you have? We got loads of good tweets about weird phobias that our viewers have been sweating over. My favourite ones uh, was from someone called M Squalor. Uh, she tweeted, I'm scared of eating out of packets. Can't eat out of a packet. Wow. I know, scared of packets. She must eat fresh food. <laughs> anyway, I thought I'd investigate into whether our panellists here tonight uh, have any oh. weird, annoying phobias that they sweat over to. Uh, we're going to play a game now, which I'm calling I'm a Celebrity. Get yeah. me out of there! <laughs> that is good. It's the Melvin's team. Mm -hmm. This one is for you. Which one of Rochelle's team has a phobia of... Oh, it's heavy. Big dead fish. Oh. <laughs> That's a real fish. Fucking stinks. <laughs> okay? There we go. Uh, which one of them has a phobia of having anything cold put on their eyes, especially, and this is a this is a great small sweat. <sighs> Watch out everyone. Cold eye cream. Ooh. <laughs> cold eye cream. Oh. And which of them? has a phobia of rats. Oh. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh, they stink, then. <laughs> Melvin's team, what do we think? Yeah. Who uh, is scared? Let's start with the fish. Who's scared of a big, fire. giant, dead fish? I reckon Rochelle's the only one who'd be like, oh, my God, cold eye cream. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's quite a demand, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. Not cold eye cream. Yeah, yeah. You know, I hate that. Because Kerry hates, like, creams in her face yeah. and stuff, so... All right, so, listen, it's Are you going to go for eye cream? going to be Rochelle. Eye cream, Rochelle. OK, Rochelle eye cream. Who is scared of big, dead fish? I think. Oh, I think sure. Oh, sure. Oh, we have a physical yeah. test. Can we just... No, we can't do that. Oh, come on. Well, then that'd be easy, wouldn't it? Mark, Mark's moving away. This will be a prize for anyone later. <laughs> Sean Fish, Mark Rats. Yeah. yeah. No, he's not. OK. I, <laughs> I hate rats. I'm going to put these rats well done, in front Grimmie. of Mark. Not the first time Mark Wright has been presented by four rats. <laughs> oh, my God, they're looking at me. Um, OK. First of all, 
Should we start with Sean Walsh? Let's find out if you're right. You'll win a pint for each one that you get right for your team. Sean, which story relates to you? What are you terrified of? What is your phobia? Oh, that one. The fish! Yay! You hate the fish? Why do you hate large dead fish? I can't even. They're just. They're so. He's really getting stressed. They're like. Right. I can't breathe. <laughs> Sean. They're, they're, uh, you, they're, for a pint for your team. Eyes, they don't show. You don't know whether they're, they're dead, but they're just looking at you going. <laughs> Sean, for a pint for your team, if you I'm grab hold of that boy. fish, pick it up and give it a kiss, I'll give you a pint. Please. Oh. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Mark, what's your phobia? Is it the rats? Yeah. It's very original, but, um. Being from Essex, I'm no Joey Essex. Oh, no. Anything cold, not necessarily uh, eye cream, Jesus anything cold Christ. near my eyes, hands, what? anything really? I can't bear. <laughs> so, Michelle, that means that you hate the rats. Oh! oh. I really, really, Oof. really hate OK, them. so all you have to do is come and join me they in the rat-infested arena to play Rochelle Touch That Rat. <laughs> come on, Rochelle! <laughs> For your team. You could win this show. Come on. I don't know if I can. Oh, and it stinks. Okay, <laughs> Rochelle. Point for your team. Just stroke that rat. Can you do it with me? I'd, no way. No way. I'm just going to stand. And I ain't going to do it. Stroke that rat. Stroke that rat. Yeah. No, touch, not stroke. Like this. this. No, A little touch. Touch, touch. Just touch, just There's touch. No just way I'm touch. Stroking. Just touch, and then once you touch it, what you have to take moves? it out with a pair. What if it moves? Of course it's going to move. It won't. It's the really tired. It's just going to move, Rochelle. Come on, Rochelle. Ah, I don't know. Okay, come on. Come on, Rochelle. Okay, everyone be calm. I don't know if I touched it. Did She's I touch got... it? We've got an action replay of Ratcam. No, I don't think. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay. 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 I hate them as well. Okay. 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 Don't prod it. Just touch it gently. Rochelle did it. We've got a rap replay. Yeah. <laughs> That sound means that we need to swap you over. So could you two remove yourselves or bugger off? And could we welcome Perry and Jade back to the show? <laughs> you're, you're gone. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome back, ladies of Little Mix. Hello. Um, Sean, what is it that you Hello. have been sweating over? Restaurants, <laughs> there is a problem. This needs to end. They're paying afterwards. Right, let's just get it out the way. I'm in, I'm in with you on that. Yes, but the I'm worst serious, thing is, go. is when you ask for a bill. This, this process needs to change, because you ask for the bill, all they do is bring you the bill, and then they leave again. Where are you going? <laughs> what do you think I'm going to do between now and paying? <laughs> do you think I'm just going to get the bill and go, right, we spent £29, right, let's go again. <laughs> think you just watch them. It takes you 20 minutes to find them in the first place, where you have to do that weird point. You know when you're trying to get them, you're talking, you go, hang on, here they, here they, here they. <laughs> yeah, so, wait, 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 they're coming, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> it's like trying to slack the taxi down at a roundabout. <laughs> <laughs> Right, let's move on to the next round. It's time for the sweat box where you get to help actual members of this actual audience. They will tell you what they've been sweating about recently, and you must do your best to help them out with advice. Whichever team they decide has given them the most help will get the point. As easy as that. So, who is first in the sweat box tonight? Hey, my name is Rex. Um, I tend to go out quite often. This is my little problem. Mm -hmm. And I get a few girls watching me, which mm -hmm. I thought was understandable. Yeah, great um, face, Rex, <laughs> not gonna lie. But when I tend to use a chart line, mm. it doesn't seem to work. 
So I was wondering if anyone's got any... Can we, can we see this in action so, so we can yeah, see what's like... going on? So, Rochelle, why don't you head over there, dance your way over with, you know, Frankie off the Saturdays or whatever. I'm just going to make it a bit more realistic. Oh, yeah. So just pretend we're in their club. Just forget about Marvin and that baby for a minute. She's shaking a thing like a Greek goddess finger. that she is. You like the look of Rex. I mean, he's smoking oh, hot, yeah, man. He's just Rex. hanging out in the sauna. <laughs> OK, Rex, give us the line. Like, what would you say to Rochelle? Hey. Just, I'm just here, my friends. Good, how you doing, right? Yeah, um, good. Is your name Google? Because you've got everything I've been searching for. Oh! Oh, yes. Is that, that, that Is your oh, name oh, Google? Because you've got everything I've been searching yeah. for. Yeah. <laughs> then it works, right? Rochelle, sit down. Oh. Rochelle, get back down quick. I thought would have worked. Oh, no. I thought would have worked. Rochelle, get back down hey. quick. Quick, oh, Rochelle. No. Uh, no. Any advice? Melvin, you're a smooth-talking man. What would you advise to Rex? I like that line. I just think you need more for your repertoire. So I've got some lines I can give to you, if you like. Oh, God. Oh, OK. All right, so first one says, do you have pet insurance? And then they go, yes or no. Then you say, cos I'm going to destroy that pussy. <laughs> That's just to warm them up. Okay. Yeah. That's a nice intro. Right. And then you say something like, do you like ladies? And then you say, because I'm a lady's nuts on your face. <laughs> no, but you've seen it. Yeah. <laughs> um, any advice, Mark? How can he get a better chat with the ladies? You're cool. OK. Don't use chat lines. Just don't. No. Ah, okay. very chat good. lines, they're like... It don't work. Strictly no. Do not listen to Melvin. Don't <laughs> OK, so your, your, your <laughs> options, don't. Rex, tonight are don't use chat-up lines. Yeah. Bear in mind, he's getting married don't to Michelle Keegan. To Mark, he's he's saying he things about murdering about. pussy and things. <laughs> so, Melvin, are you single? Yeah! OK. <laughs> Whose advice, who's advice do you want to take, Rex? Um, I'm going to go with Mark's, actually. Yeah, oh. I think I'll go with Michelle's. Oh. Sorry, Sorry. 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 <laughs> Well, that was the end of the show, so will Jesse and Leanne please come back? Hi, girls. Hello. Hi, ladies. Hello. All of Little Mix are together! Hello. Oh, my God. You, these two have been slagging you two off. Oh, no, my God. <laughs> It has not stopped all bloody night. Uh, so that's the end of this series of Sweat the Small Stuff. And so the only thing left to do is announce the winner. Now, would the security guards who have been protecting the trophy all week please bring it on so that I can present it to the winner of Series 2 of Sweat the Small Stuff. <laughs> Slightly bigger than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> oh wow. I mean it's so big you can't even see me. <laughs> the star of the show. <laughs> Let's get tense up in this bitch. <laughs> um, okay. I'm gonna have to get round in front of it because it's too bleeding big. Melvin, if you'd like to come and join us up here, Rochelle, if you could join us as well up here. It's really is uh it's a big moment wow. for for BBC That's three strong. and television as a whole, I think. Right. Okay, the winner. I know everyone's excited. Sweat the smallest of series two. Ah. Winner of the show and the winner of the series. It's bloody Rochelle's team. Yeah! We'd all like to come on, Rochelle. It's a great moment. Congratulations to you. The trophy's yours, Rochelle. This is for you. So, that is it for the series. A big thank you to Mark, to Jolion, Little Mix, Sean, and especially to the show's amazing team captain, Rochelle Kings and Melvin Ojo! This has been Twitter, the Snorter Series 2. I've been Nick Rusha. You've been so beautiful. Good night, everybody. Bye. And we've more of the funny stuff tomorrow night at 10 as Lethal Bizzle and Nick Hewer join Jack for all new back chat. While on Thursday at 10, the wedding continues as Laura deals with a shocking revelation in brand new Him and Her on 3. And EastEnders is next. <laughs>